Hi guys, this video to show you how to measure the 2D radiation pattern of the directional antenna using Fieldfox. Okay, so the main instruments connection setup will be like the Fieldfox here. The port 1 will connect to the TS module of the Dreamcatcher training kit and the port 2 will connect to the RS module of the Dreamcatcher training kit. Okay, so the PC here is like connect the USB to rotate the RS module. So the antenna here will rotate 360 degree. And the LAN cable here is to for the PC to control the field fox. Alright, so the connection will be like this and our patch antenna for the directional antenna will connect to the TS module here and another one will be in RS module here. So here will be the real case setup. So we have our field fox here. Our port 1 is connecting to the TX and our port 2 is connecting to RX. So here will be our transmitting antenna here will be our receive receiving antenna okay so here will be the rx to the port 2 okay and our usb is connect to our pc so we will use our red pad software here to connect the training kits so this is this software will be like our red pad v4.20 dream from dream catcher and we just click on the setting here and then connect to the com okay once connect the com here will connected and the instrument setting had not done so we can click on use vna and connect with the instrument ip address okay and then we click on connect so once connect then we can control the field fox okay then we can save so when they are homing so you can see they are start connecting so the antenna will rotate all right so next we will go for okay we can go for the fuel force display and check is it our connection is correct is connected so we can go for the red pad here and we set the frequency so let's check together so here is the fuel fox here is the frequencies so we can do it like so here is four gigahertz so we can see four gigahertz here and one megahertz here so let's say i make it like two three zero zero three hundred 2300 megahertz and 2500 megahertz because I'm going to measure 2.4 gigahertz uh, frequency antenna. Okay, so I will set the output power is 0 dBm and then we just click on configure. We, we can see here the field force should be become like 2300 megahertz to 2500 megahertz will be like 2.3 giga and 2.5 giga here. Okay, so we just click on configure. Let's see. So we can see our field fox here now is 2.3 gigahertz and stop will be 2.5 gigahertz. You also can view from the camera here. Our camera here. So you can see the line is exactly the same as the display here. Okay. Now we are make sure the red pad here is controlling our field fox and then we can start for the measurement. So we can see the power level is negative 35. So if we change the power level, what will happen? It's reduced negative 5 dBm. So if I reduce again, then this should be become 45. Okay, so it's good. Then we can make it like 0 dBm. The power received become negative 35. And then we can start our measurement. So we can choose our S11. We can view our S11 here. And we also can view the 2D or the 3D. So we're going to measure the 2D. So we click on Polar and we can click Run. So when we click Run, then the antenna here will start rotating and we will get a directional antenna radiation pattern. So you can see it start rotating now. Okay.
Okay, so once done, then we can go back and check our result. So you can see the radiation pattern now is one directional. It's a directional antenna. Okay, and we can check from the theory. So we can check on our simulation. Let's say this one is a patch antenna, far field. So you can see the radiation pattern also in one direction. So it's almost similar as this like patch antenna. And we can make it like in 1D plot here, the polar, so it's like directional here. Okay, so we can view it like this. So this one is like in DB form, this one is in linear, so linear will be clearly like one direction. And this one will be like DB, so it's a directional. And here is the DB you can see is also a directional radiation pattern. Okay, so we can view from here, it's exactly the same, so it's proven, and we also can check on the theory. So we can check on the theory here. So the patch antenna is a direction antenna. Their radiation will be something like what only focus on one direction. Okay. So you we will get something like this. Okay, guys. So that's all for showing like how to measure two D radiation pattern antenna using Fox. Thank you.